Hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys, girls, dogs, and cats, and welcome to a sort of like new little discussion ramble thing I kind of decided I wanted to do. I wanted it to kind of be sort of like an update video, except just be long, and uh, I just get to talk and stuff, because that's what I've kind of felt like I wanted to do. I just kind of wanted to talk today. <laughs> um, I'm not sure when this is going to go up. Probably today. Probably today I'm really recording this. Today I'm recording on the 5th of October, which is pretty cool. Um, sorry if you can hear a dog in the background. It's actually all the way in the backyard, but I hope you can't hear that. Anyways, um, so this will be like an update thing, and then maybe I can do this more often if you guys sort of enjoy this. I'm not sure what I'm going to call this yet, but um, it'll be something like rambling or whatever. Uh, but yeah, so um, I, I would like to update on you on a few things. Um, first of all, I'm having a sort of a computer situation here right now. Um, first of all, my laptop that I do everything off of, it's a nice laptop, don't get me wrong, but about like six months ago or something like that, um, my laptop's, one of its hinges, the left hinge, just started like coming apart. And like, so now it won't close or anything. It's not, It's been like this for about six months, which I mean, you know what, if I don't move it and I just kind of leave it on my desk, it's not that bad of a problem because it just stays there and I don't have to close it or anything. But um, it's getting worse <laughs> and like uh, part of the screen is starting to come off um, because of the hinges pulling it off and the hinge itself is coming apart. There's two pieces that used to be together um, that were just kind of slipping out from a different piece. And now those two pieces are kind of coming apart and I can see wires and lights and shit in there. Um, and then... Also, now within the week, um, there is now a crack running through my screen, the bottom left corner, um, <laughs> which it, it's not that bad of a crack, to, to be fair, but it still is a crack, and oh, it's go it's way longer now, actually. It goes all the way through the, the black part of the screen that it doesn't actually show any uh, data or anything, but it, there is a small crack that runs through the bottom left corner. And I mean, it's pretty invisible, to be honest. Like, I wouldn't notice it if I was playing some game or anything. But I'm just sitting here looking at my desktop like, holy shit, there's a big crack in my, in my computer. Um, but good news, I already ordered a new computer from iBuyPower.com. Not sponsor, I promise. Um, I, I dropped like 13 on it. Um, which is, I mean, I've been saving up for this computer. I've been putting it off since June. I thought I was going to be able to get it in June, then I thought I was going to be able to get it in August, then I thought I was going to be able to get it in September, now I'd be able to get it in October, and it'll be here in like a week. So, um, my FPS is going to be way huger, uh, I'm going to have a better internet connection, I'm getting this new internet thing with it too. It's all going to be good, um, I'm really excited about it, it's going to be great, I'm getting another monitor too, so I'll have like three monitors, fucking be nice. And, uh, yeah, and I'll be able to, like, record a lot more because, um, I wanted to do a lot more console things on this channel, um, and that's sort of where it failed was because I couldn't record console because what I was doing was I was using Elgato, and the Elgato files that it made after I recorded, like, Fallout 3 or something, um, were too huge for my editing or any editor on my computer at all it would crash immediately um, because the files were like eight gigs. <laughs> um, but my new computer will be able to um, run eight gigabyte MP4s that my Elgato makes. So it'll be nice, you know. I'll be able to record shit in 1080 now instead of 720 which i feel i've felt really bad recording in 720 because i'll like look back at my youtube video it looks like trash like not not joking it looks like trash but um i'm sorry if you guys are sick of the 720 thing that'll end soon <laughs> um but anyways yeah i'm getting a new pc i'll do like an uh, unboxing video or something with it just to like show you guys like how awesome it's gonna be or something um i got like a 970 in it and um I don't know, a few other things, like 600 watts power, I don't know, I can't remember the the other stuff. I got um, 16 gigabytes of RAM, which is pretty fucking nice. It, it was, um, I, if you select it at the time, it was 8 gigs, and if you select it, if you were going to buy 8 gigs, it was a free upgrade to 16, so it's like, fuck, that's awesome. <laughs> um, 
Anyway, some other stuff. Um, I'm going to record this weekend um, with Dustin Lint and probably my friend Dominic. If you don't know who Dominic is, he was um, the guy that I actually started this channel with originally. Um, if you go back and like watch my Portal videos and stuff, he's in them all. And then like the Starbound videos, he's in them. And... Well, a few other things. Um, the bad, the not bad board games. The um, board game online videos he's in, and I'm pro probably missing a few things that he's probably into. Um, but yeah, it was supposed to be us two, and then he ended up just really not being able to be there. He did just didn't have the time or whatever, which is understandable. It's totally fine. So um, I just basically took over the channel, and now here we are. But um, he's had some time recently, and I was thinking, you know, with Dominic. We should have recorded again. So me, Dustin, Lent, and Dominic, and then hopefully a fourth person are going to play this indie game that Dustin Lent gave me for free because he had like 10 copies or some shit. Um, I can't remember what it's called, but it'll be fun. I think a lot of people on YouTube are playing it right now for like tournaments and stuff. It's like a four-player indie sort of like colorful don't die, be the last person to die sort of thing, um, which are always great for recording. Uh, it'll be fun. And I'm really looking forward to that. Me and Demon are still recording. Um, I I think uh, I've lost a couple of recordings with them, with that, um, which kind of sucks. But they will be coming out. Um, basically, I upgraded my recording software and uh, all my recordings from previous update, updation are now um, corrupted, and if I open them, it crashes. So I cannot do that anymore. I lost all those old ones. Probably just delete them so I can make more space. Um, but yeah, there's that. So I'll be recording with Dustin Land and Demon, and I'll be doing Millionaire and stuff. And then when I get my new computer, I'm gonna try to move away from Minecraft as much as possible. I think um, the next Mineshaft season, I'm gonna say I don't want in because I'll be honest, I think Minecraft is a really boring game. <laughs> I don't enjoy it anymore. Uh, I mean, I don't get that spark that I used to, you know, when you like first find the game and you're just like, oh, this is amazing. And you're like exploring everything. I don't get that anymore. Um, the only times it's fun is like online with friends, which the SMP is online with friends and it's pretty fun. Um, or mods like Millionaire. Millionaire is great. I really enjoy it. Um, I really enjoy recording it. It's really fun. So I'm going to keep doing that stuff, but I'm going to try and probably just keep it to that sort of thing. And then at the, at the end of this season of the SMP, which will probably be still a few more months, um, I'm going to say I don't want it. And you, I don't want anything to do with it anymore because, you know, it's just boring and it doesn't get as much views as my other stuff. Whatever, you know, that's not the main reason, but it's one of the reasons, I guess. Um, yeah, and I want to get to just more other games, um, more console games, like GTA and stuff with Nate. That'd be pretty fun, right? Um, and some other things. I got a PS4 now, and so if you have a PSN, you can add me or whatever. Mine's just calm down, level up if you want to play PS4 or GTA or something. I'll be down. Um, but yeah, so um, some other stuff. Uh what games have I been playing recently? What games have you guys been playing recently? Write in the comments. How about that? I've been I just just started playing Hearthstone and it's fantastic. I am a lifelong Yu-Gi-Oh fan. I fucking love that game. I have like ten thousand. No, I don't have ten thousand. I probably have like two thousand cards or something just in boxes over there, on top of my desk or on top of my drawers. <laughs> um, I have a lot of cards. I used to go to tournaments and stuff. Um, I'm going to keep them forever because they're good memories of when I was little and 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 now. I still look at them now, <laughs> but they're great. I'm not ashamed of that. But Hearthstone is really good because um, it's designed to be online and digital. And it's so much easier just to go on Hearthstone and play people than it is to drive over to the comic shop and go to a tournament for Yu-Gi-Oh! Um, or there's, I mean, there's the online versions of Yu-Gi-Oh too, but again, Hearthstone is designed to be digital, so it works way better and all the cards work. Like sometimes on the online version of Yu-Gi-Oh, 
some of the cards just don't work because they have to code each individual card into the game. With Hearthstone, all of the abilities and stuff are pretty similar. Um, like there's none that just stand out crazy, so it's all really easy and stuff. Hearthstone's also a lot sim simpler of a game. Um, it's really good. If any of you play it too, you can add my battle net. I think it's um, Poopin' On You is my name, but with the hashtag 1880. Poopin, P O O P I N on you. That's, and then at number 1880. Shut up. Stop doing that, dog. <laughs> That's my number uh, for Battle.net, you can add me and stuff, play. I, I just started, so I'm like really bad. <laughs> um, but I'm like learning as, as uh, best I can, I promise. I'm training with, with Dominic, actually, and some other friends. Um, so yeah, there's that. And uh, other games I've been playing, actually, I've been playing the other Blizzard game, uh, Heroes of the Storm. Oh, that game is really good. Um, uh, it's so much better than League, to be honest. Like, there's so much better aspects about it. It's not... I, I could go on for a long time about how much better Heroes is than um, than League. But And if you're not into those kind of games, too. I'm not really either. Uh, I wasn't into League. I played, like, a few games. I really didn't enjoy it. Um, and then I got into Heroes of the Storm. And Heroes of the Storm is fantastic. Um what else what else do i have to say today um i have been uh trying to okay so like over the summer i binge watched all of game of thrones okay so game of thrones is fantastic okay and um i got really addicted to it and then when i finished it you know if you've watched it you know how season five fucking ends like holy shit right um and so i had this this uh this game of thrones itch that it had it had to be scratched and so um i found westeros craft it's it's a it's a server um for uh game of thrones and it's awesome um it's not done yet though basically if you've ever seen uh those like 3d renders of um king's landing from from game of thrones built in minecraft before that's that build is from this server westeros craft so they have like really fantastic builders and stuff um and basically what the server is right now is just you get there and then you fly around in in the creative mode or in a spectator mode and you just look at the builds or you can apply to be a builder and um that's what i've been doing i've been practicing building doing little build applications um and stuff so i'm trying to get accepted it's really hard these people are like really top of the line builder people you know what i'm saying <laughs> um so yeah, I've been like building houses and stuff and they've been like, yeah, go to this, go to this warp and try to build one of these houses. Okay, you did that. Now go to this warp and build one of these houses. Um, so I've been doing that too, like at nights and stuff. That's pretty fun. Um, that's what I've been doing with that sort of thing. And well, I hope to become a builder and um, help finish the project because um, I know I'm not that good of a builder, but this is like totally helping me out, like learn pretty well um and because when the server is finished then it's going to be released into a full like role play kind of server so everyone can will like be role playing as lords or soldiers in the armies and stuff and it'll be just really good i think it'll be great so i want to help finish it as fast as possible and i want to encourage all of you if you guys are good builders and you're into game of thrones to go to westeroscraft.com Log in or sign up or whatever and um, go on the server and just fly around and just look at how amazing it is and then try to become builder too. Yes, do it. Well, I think that's pretty good of a little ramble thing. Thank you all for watching. If you liked this, please just hit the like button and, and stuff. Or if you don't have to, if you don't want to. But if you don't, um, I mean, there's no promise that you'll wake up tomorrow. You know, just putting that out there. Just putting that out there. <laughs> all right. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time when I talk about dead reindeer.